Sociopolitical commentator Dwyer Astafan is raising the red flag on the decline of social values in the country, particularly exhibited during the recent carnival on St. Kitts. According to Astafan, there was a high display of vulgarity, much of which he said is not the culture of St. Kitts and Nevis, but the copying of carnival bad practices from the carnivals of Brazil and Trinidad. Asafan said much of it was being displayed by women, exhibiting little self-respect in their behavior on the road in what he believes were inappropriate costuming. Women, many of them mothers, parading the streets in a state of near nakedness. One of them later told me she had done it to relieve stress. Now I can see jumping up and having a good time, being a stress reliever. But how do these public displays of vulgar, near nakedness, bending over, twerking, exposing your nether tenderness, and having men walk up on you relieve stress? How does objectifying yourself with any number of men taking turns on your behind in front of the world relieve your stress? How can you do that? and face your children? Is there perhaps a hidden devil in you which needs that sort of degradation to validate itself? Or are you unaware of the fact that you are indeed degrading yourself? Now don't tell me that this is our culture because it is not. It is imported crudeness from Brazil and Trinidad. Indeed, there's nothing cultural about it. It is just vulgar and unbecoming. And we are such copycats, even when we are copying behaviors that diminish us, we copy still. Are you going to tell me that there are so many of our women in this country who are suffering from such a low level of self-esteem that they would make themselves a public spectacle like this? As if I noted also that many people might not see anything wrong with it, suggesting the corruption of their minds as well. They say that this is what people do nowadays. Go with the flow. This is young people thing. And people are freer than they used to be. Freer to express themselves. What is wrong with this is that if people are freer to express themselves and they choose to do so in ways that degrade them and degrade the human condition in our country, then we are all on the way to hell in a handbasket. This is not a good direction for us as women, as men, as families, which to a large extent in St. Kitts, unfortunately, the word families is more a word than an institution. And this is where the breakdown begins. Things are bad and getting worse. What will our children be seeing and doing 10, 20, 30 years from now? Asafan encourages citizens to go online and look at the traditional and cultural dances of some African countries, saying the crudeness that we are seeing in the Sinkis Carnival Parade is nothing culturally and historically intrinsic to the people of St. Kitts and Nevis. Glenn Bart reporting for SK Newsline.